The National Science and Math Quiz is an annual science and mathematics content-based national level quiz competition for senior high schools in Ghana. It began in 1994 and has since become the ultimate battleground for the brightest minds across the nation. Year after year, we witness the relentless pursuit of victory as schools battle it out for academic supremacy. Amidst this fierce competition and relentless passion, there are quite a few top schools that have never won the prestigious National Science and Math Quiz title. Join me and watch till the end as I bring you this interesting story of 10 Category A schools that have never won, surprisingly, the National Science and Math Quiz. Since the inception of the competition, only two all-female schools have made it to the finals. Do you know which schools they are? Tell us in the comment section. And without wasting time, let's dive right into it. The 10th school is Accra Girls Senior High School. We begin their journey from 2016, where out of the 134 schools from all regions that competed, only 27 qualified for the quarterfinals. And guess what? Accra Girls was not one of them. In 2021, a similar story unfolded as Accra Girls Chemo Senior High School and Christian Methodist Senior High School competed for the original qualifiers. The contest ended with Chemo Senior High School in the lead with 57 points, Christian Methodist School in the second place with 19 points, and Accra Girls Senior High School in the last place with 15 points. This marked the end of the road for Accra Girls that year. In 2022, Accra Girls again could not make it to the original qualifiers. They were sent packing at the preliminary stage of the contest. West African Senior High School came out as the winner in that contest and Accra Girls Senior High School lost. The story isn't any better for Accra Girls in 2023 as they competed in the Greater Accra Regional Qualifiers. They competed with Ada Senior High School and Chimu Senior High School with Chimu Senior High School coming out with the highest score whilst Accra Girls Senior High School lost. The ninth school is Bishop Herman Senior High School. We begin their journey in 2017 where they made it to the 18th state of the National Science and Math Quiz where they competed with St. Thomas Aquinas and Jasso Senior High Technical School. St. Thomas Aquinas came out victorious with 67 points whilst Bishop Herman lost with 34 points. In 2020, Bishop Herman once again qualified for the 18th stage where they met Adisadel College and Takwa SHS. Guess what? Adisadel College came out victorious and Bishop Herman lost. In 2021, the same story unfolded as Bishop Herman qualified for the 1 8 stage but failed to qualify for the quarterfinals in a contest between them, Adisadel College and Osetutu. Again, Adisadel College came out victorious and Bishop Herman lost. In 2022, the story was different. Bishop Herman qualified for the quarterfinal stage, but unfortunately, they did not make it to the semi-finals in a contest between them and Kumasi Senior High. Unfortunately for them, Kumasi High School won that contest and they lost. The eighth school is St. Louis Senior High School. As a Category A school, we expect a lot from them. And truly, in 2021, they did well as they qualified for the quarterfinals of the National Science and Math Quiz only to compete with Keta Senior High Technical School, where they lost. St. Louis Senior High School scored 51 points, whilst Keta Senior High Technical School scored 68 points, making them the winner in that contest. It is, however, not doom and gloom for St. Louis Senior High School. In 2017, they did well by qualifying for the 1-8th state of the competition, where they met Prime College and Tuasi SHS. Unfortunately, in both instances, they did not get far. That was the end. They never actually made it to the finals of the National Science and Math Quiz, and they never actually won the trophy. The seventh school is Notre Dame Seminary SHS. We begin their story from 2014, where they did well by qualifying for the quarterfinals, but competed for a slot in the semifinals with Kumasi Academy and Maoli SHS. Unfortunately, as you may have guessed, the journey ended prematurely for them. In 2016, the story was a little better 
as they were part of the qualifiers at the preliminary stage, they also qualified for the 1-8 stage but unfortunately lost to Wesley Girls Senior High School. In 2018 and 2020, they again contested in the preliminary stage but unfortunately failed to qualify for the 1-8 stage where they lost miserably. In 2022, the story was much better for Notre Dame Seminary SHS as they qualified for the 1-8 stage of the competition only to compete with Swedro SHS and Sims SHS. Unfortunately, Swedro SHS came out with a 15-point gap and so Notre Dame Seminary lost. It was the same story in 2021 for Notre Dame Seminary SHS as they happily got a place in the 1-8 stage of the contest but failed to qualify for the quarter-final stage having lost to St. Peter's Senior High School who booked a landslide victory. Before we move on, if you are new to this channel, part tune, be sure to subscribe if you are interested in videos like this that talk about schools and jobs in Ghana and Africa. The sixth school is St. Mary's Senior High School. In 2018, they faced Accra Academy and Anglo Afiade Nyingwa in the preliminary stage. Unfortunately, Accra Academy put up the better performance and won that challenge. St. Mary's SHS tasted a little bit of victory in 2021 when they passed the 1 8 stage only to meet Presec Legon and Ghana SHS Tamale. And this may come as no surprise, but Presec Legon won that challenge. This marked the end of the competition for St. Mary's SHS. The story was no different for them in 2019 and in 2020 where they contested at the 1 8 stage and the preliminary stage, respectively but failed to move on in both stages. The conclusion being that they have never made it to the finals and have never won the National Science and Math Quiz. Their fifth school is Archbishop Porter's SHS. Not much can be said about their performance. In 2017, they won their contest at the 1-8 stage between Tema Secondary School and Kintampo SHS. They then qualified for the quarterfinals contesting with Ibrigo Secondary School and Ghana National College. Unfortunately, Ghana National College knocked out Ibrigo Senior High School and Archbishop Porter's girls in the first series of the quarterfinals to qualify for the semi-finals. This marked the end of the road for Archbishop Porter's girls. Unfortunately, the story has not been better subsequently and previously for Archbishop Porter's girls in the competition. And because of this, they have also never made it to the finals and have never won the National Science and Maths quiz. The fourth school is Infantiman Girls Senior High School. Infantiman is one of the only two all-girls senior high school to have ever made it to the finals of the National Science and Maths quiz. This was in 2013, where Infantiman became the second runner-up with St. Thomas Aquinas winning the trophy. Unfortunately, for the third consecutive year, Infantiman lost the opportunity to participate in the national championship as they lost the contest to Assen State College. Assen State College beat Infantiman in 2019 and returned in 2020 even stronger to beat them again at the regional qualifiers. It is not all bad news however, as Infantiman girls in 2016 and 2017 qualified for the 1-8 stage of the National Science and Maths Quiz. They also qualified for the quarter-final stage in 2015 and 2016 in order to make it to the semi-final stage but unfortunately in both instances, they never won the trophy. The third school is Accra Academy. In 2016, 2018 and 2019, they made it to the quarter-finals of the National Science and Maths Quiz but however, that was as far as they went. In 2020, hopes were very high for Accra Academy as they toppled the 2019 champions, St. Augustine College, in an incredible battle of wits in the quarter-final stage. Accra Academy made it to the semi-final stage, but unfortunately, Opokuwari came out the winner and secured the first slot in the finals. In 2021, Accra Academy was again hopeful as they passed the 1-8 stage and made it to the quarter-final stage to compete with KNUST SHS and Ola SHS. Unfortunately, they didn't make it far in that competition as well. Will the story be different in 2022? Accra Academy, 
Our Lady of Mount Carmel and Edu Jeffy SHS competed in a battle for a spot in the quarterfinals. Edu Jeffy and Mount Carmel gave Accra Academy a good fight. However, Accra Academy was victorious in that contest. Accra Academy then went on to have a heated contest with Legon Presec and Pujos. As you may have guessed, Presec was victorious and Accra Academy lost. This was the end for Accra Academy. Unfortunately, Accra Academy never won the title as the National Science and Maths Quiz champions. The second school, shockingly, is Every Girl Senior High School. We began their journey from 2017 and 2018 where they qualified and passed the 1-8th stage of the competition and made it to the quarterfinal stage. However, they never made it to the semi-finals. In 2020, they performed reasonably well in the regional qualifiers with a total of 25 points where they were placed in pot C with pot A being the best in the contest. The good news for Brie Girls is that in 2021, they qualified for the 1-8th stage of the competition and competed with Wesley Girls and St. Francis Xavier Junior Seminary Senior High School. Unfortunately, Ebri Girls withdrew from the competition, allowing St. Roses to qualify and to participate in the preliminary stage of the competition. Will things be different for Ebri Girls in 2022? The contest between Ebri Girls SHS and the Dujenfi SHS was full of tension, excitement, and drama. Unfortunately, a Dujenfi proved to be too difficult for a Brie Girls, and as such, a Brie Girls lost. A Brie Girls did not qualify for the 1-8th stage for the National Science and Maths Quiz in 2022. A Brie Girls Senior High School has never made it to the finals of the National Science and Maths Quiz since its inception. We are now in 2023. Things are looking good. A Brie Girls has passed the regional championship and has qualified for the national championship. How far they will go remains to be seen. The first and most shocking school to have never won the National Science and Maths Quiz is Wesley Girls Senior High School. It is one of the two all-female schools to have ever made it to the finals of the National Science and Maths Quiz. They set this record in 1999 as they came up as the first runner-up but were beaten by Infantipim School. In 2017 and in 2018, they made it to the quarterfinal stage only to be ousted and never quite made it to the semi-finals. In 2019, Wesley Girls Senior High School did much better. They passed the quarterfinal stage and qualified for the semi-finals where they kicked out the four-time champion Prime College and the two-time champion Achimota School. They then lost to the reigning champion St. Peter's Senior High School. In 2020 and in 2021, Wesley Girls Senior High School once again did well and passed the 1-8th stage of the National Science and Maths Quiz and made it to the semi-finals, but unfortunately, that is where their race ended. They lost. In 2022, the stage was set between Wesley Girls, Awudomi SHS and Maoli School. Unfortunately, Wegehe lost to Maoli School. This was forever marked as a historic loss for Wesley Girls Senior High School. If you'd like to see the schools that have won the most National Science and Maths quiz, click on the next video. As always, you can read more about the topic from my website, patstune.com. Thanks for watching, and if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.